I think the most important thing that you can do with your data bank is, is segment it. But by far, no ifs, ands, or buts, it needs to be segmented. What I mean by that is you've got to create small pockets of people. So this way you're not going into a database and have a thousand people and have no clue who's who and who's doing what. So what you want to do, obviously, is separate sellers from buyers. That's the most basic segment. And then you want to do what I call ABCD, right? You want to, what you want to do is you want to take your hottest leads, okay? The hottest leads for me, each person might be different. For me, it's someone that's going to be listing their home or condo in the next 30 days or very likely to list in the next 30 days. So those people I'm going to tag with, call them a, my A leads, right? So those are going to get segmented in a separate folder or tag or depending on what CRM you're using, but those are going to stand out from the rest. And mm -hmm. then the people that aren't selling in the next 30 days, but might be selling in the next six to 12 months, those are going to be my B leads. So those will also be segmented or separated from the general database. Okay. And then there's going to be um, C leads for me is someone that is not quite going to do something in the next 12 months, but kind of, we've been having a conversation. They're on the fence, maybe a year or two down the road. I'll tag those as a C. And then I've got D, which is the rest of the general database. Okay. But I think it's really important that, you know, when I go in every single morning, Every single morning, I open up my CRM and I'm looking at my A leads. And these are the people that I'm talking to on a daily basis because the next conversation is very likely that they're going to list their home. So I think the first thing that you can do, the most important thing, is start to create some sort of segmentation so you're able to filter out people and be able to go in um, as needed to have conversations with them. Um, yeah. And another thing to segment them is, is where they own, you know, if it's a condo owner versus a home, um, what community they own in, what building they own in. So if I sold a if I sold a condo in a Breakers Resort, I can go into my CRM right now and pull out every single person that I have that owns a Breakers. So then I can actually call them or, or send out a campaign to them or whatever it may be. But I think segmenting by far the most important thing in my opinion to do with your database to start.